Hello, beautiful people. You're most welcome to Footprints with Beth Well. Today, I bring you yet another episode of Mwe 101, uh, my journey to perfect my Mwe speech and, of course, learn more about the Bangwa language. And today, we are going to be talking about, about some household stuff. So please, stay glued and check us out as I hook up with um, a very, very um, informed young Bangwa man, um, Mr. Tongte Princely, all the way from the US. He's joining us on the platform today to help us go through this. And I'm so happy to, to, to welcome him to the platform. Um, welcome, Mr. Princely, and thank you so much for accepting to do this, for accepting to move more forward. <laughs> thank you, you're most welcome. All right. Thank you. All right. This and um, where we are talking, apparently most of my guests happen to come from um, Lewa. And someone whispered in my ears to say, um, this language, the Mwe language, there are nine chiefdoms in the Bangwa community or on the Bangwa clan, but the Mwe language is not understood by most of them. So what do you, what's your take on that? The Bangwa, the Mwe language that we are talking here, who do you think quite under, uh, would, would, would understand um, the, the Nguyen language we're using on this program? Yeah, uh, the Nguyen language that we're about to speak or learn something in this program is mostly spoken by the Indungate people, some people call them the Alo, mm -hmm. the Lewo people, the Lebang people, some people call them Menji or Fontem, which is Lebang, mm -hmm. then the Esoata people. When these four people speak, it's easy for them to understand what they're talking about. It's, it's easy for a sort of man to speak, the war person understand. It's easy for a man to speak, the bank person understand. It's easy for the bank man to speak, the war person understand. I mean, like they have that uniformity. It is easier for them to understand the Ingwe. But going to other villages of the, of the nine that you just said, mm -hmm. like if you go to like Fongotongong, you go to like Mokbin, Mok, uh, Moklet uh, for Zimonde, mm -hmm. They don't understand this and where the way these four people, these four villages I just called spoke. All right. Okay. So then where we speak is typical for this group of people. But I know there's another part of where that's called Mwe Mundani. I don't know if it's part of the Bangwa community or is the Wabane community. I don't know. All of them are Bangwa people. Mm. All of them are Bangwa people. Because if you see uh the word this like, I don't know I'm not like deviating from uh the 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 the, the, the subject mm -hmm. to be discussed but I am from what I understand is they say bangwa that bar you see like most tribes in Cameroon like they start with that bar yeah you see the bar means people of yeah. that bar means people of people of Mwe. yeah so the bangwa is like People of Mwe. Mm. Yeah, you because that like Mwe is actually yeah. a, a mispronunciation of Mwe. Yes, it's okay. people of Mwe. You see, Bakosi, like people of Kosi, something like that. Yeah. Bamileke, people of Leke, it goes like that. So mm. Bangwa goes like people of Mwe. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, but so, I think I think that it's, it's more geographical. I, I think that sometimes... People just find themselves together because the poly politics of the community has carved out that area and said, you belong together. You are Bangwa people. That's why we see that in the Bangwa clan, there are people who speak this way that we understand and the people who speak other languages that personally I can't even understand. Me yeah. too. Yeah. Me too. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. It's, uh, it's, it's, just, it's just interesting the way this whole culture and clan thing works. But we are Bangwa people and... We we, we, we cannot we cannot people. we cannot cut off ourselves from that yes okay let's jump into the first thing we're going to talk about today household stuff ndichindia I think that's how it's called I don't know ndichindia <laughs> chindia non tichi where did I get ndichi from not ndichi <laughs> but it's it's remember it's remember remember when Kaya song we were talking the ndichindia we were talking the chindia. All right, all right, all right. Yeah. Okay. So, ote, ote, ote fe. Okay. <laughs> because mm. I've always known Dichi. 
they cheat to make things like things or stuff so household mm-hmm. stuff in chindia yeah. or in the chindia it's not it's not yeah. wrong okay mm-hmm. so um first on my list i have chairs chairs Alana. okay what about cupboards is that word for like storage Cobras. boxes or cupboards yeah Cobras Cobras and Akim. Akim. Mm. Akim or Akim. 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 Oh, Cobot. I would take Akim or Unkim. Okay, Akim or Unkim. That's Cobot. Unkim. Yeah, let's take, let's go with Unkim. Okay. Cobot. How do we say Cobot? We just said Unkim. Okay. Nare. Okay, Nare. It's so jury. Okay. Okay, Nare and Kim. Nkanankim or can we say Nkanantinkim? Nkanantinkim, same thing. Okay, okay, okay. So the cupboard and it's like a storage box. So storage boxes and cupboards are like almost the same thing. And no storage box, what on the inka? All right, yeah. Okay. Um, television. Ah. <laughs> uh. Uh, the quarrel among the Indian videos, eh? Moving the food, I go as a zero. Okay, set up. Play television of Ella. They won't get a good bong or television. Okay, Jimbo up to about 25 years ago. Yeah, so we never put my way, little and bobo established. Yeah, but a bobo, more than bobo, my man, the quarter bong, you won't talk about all. So, what if you say Nunu and Duck is more of pictures, not the TV TV per se? Yes. So the TV is mostly called TV simply or television simply. Put on that television. Yeah. Yeah. We will in in the over the chums. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, but I know radio. Radio. I don't know. Some uh, long. What on the long? The long. The long. Okay. Um, light bulb. As a mu okay. Light bulb or lamp. Mm, with a tongue in Cabo, who tongue that Turukan. <laughs> yeah, I know a Turukan. Okay, uh, what about ladder? Is there a word for ladder? A cop. Yeah, because we use the a cop to get to the, the can. Mm-hmm. Okay, I, I've not forgotten my my more experience. <laughs> okay, what yeah. about mat? Is there a word for mat? Do we use the mat in the community? Atesek, atesek. The mat, atesek. Yes. Okay. Now let's go to the toilet. Things that are normally found in the toilet or the bathroom. We have bucket. Mm-hmm. How do we say bucket in where? Ati. 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 Atinsa. 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 Okay. We have soap. Ah, uh, that soap of the thing. <laughs> soap. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, what on the asok? Asok. Asok. Okay, I say I'm going to tell you that the you are full like your tongue, but it's a quarter of your tongue. What on the asok? Okay, but generally it's called asok. 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 But there's a deeper yeah, name. Yes, there is another name. Uh, mm. but I talk to you. Mm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. So the name of 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 the name the farm. So generally, those things are stored in the kitchen. I think yeah, they are stored mm-hmm. in the in the kitchen. How's that store? Dang. In dang, in the dang. Dang. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, what about um needle or thread? Needle mm-hmm. symbol Mhm. Thread. Uh, thread and thread and dab, dab. Needle, lesa, thread, dab. 
Ndap, ndap. Ndap, ndap. Mm. Okay. Let's come to the kitchen then. Let's talk about some kitchen utensils and other stuff in the kitchen. We have um, kitchen utensils. We have pots. Lukung. Yeah, lukung. Um, lukung, le- le- yeah. The soup pot. Yeah, that is soup. <laughs> okay, um, we have the fireplace. The fireplace. Three stones. How do we call the three stones? Yeah, ntomok. Okay, ntomok, and then the... The, the the fireplace itself is called Litemok. Litemok, yes. Okay. Nto is like a support, right? Yes. Nto is like a support, yeah. Okay. Mm. Uh, we have a pan, bowl, plates. I think it's the same thing in where? No. It's not? Okay. How do we call a bowl? <laughs> How do we call a bowl? Uh, the bowl goes with the pan. Butong the kwang kwang. Kwang kwang. Kwang kwang. Kwang kwang. Kwang kwang. Yeah, I will feel that pan, pan, but I will feel that pan, uh huh, or bowl. Then, yes, and then uh, a plate, put on the indionyo. Oh my god, I've never heard that. Indionyo, yeah, indionyo, yeah. All right, okay, good to know. And then we have a cup, come on, some bullet, dong, 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 sir, or dong, bulu. Yeah, and don't sell on dong bulu. <laughs> okay, and then we have um cutlery. Um we have spoons. Lelu. Knife. Me. Is there a word for fork? No, that I know of. Yeah, because I think the fork is not really, really part of the Bangwak uh, culture of eating the eating yeah. culture. We yeah. mostly use a spoon because, or the hands. Yeah. Because I'm going to be all right i'm going to look i'm going to look over the over the over the people call a lot more long to more long to call a loop more like a yes 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 okay i understand no. it now yeah because yeah. in those like back in the day when the language was been established we used to use wood to, to, to like mm-hmm. wood, uh, the, the cutlery were made out of wood, not metal. So they didn't think about the fork. So we have just the spoon. Yeah, yeah all right. Okay, and what about the mortar? Very, very important in the Bangwa kitchen. <laughs> mortar. Ukat. Ukat. And the Ukat. pistol. At obe. At obe. Ukat. And at obe. And then what about um, the grinding stone? Aritisok. Aritisok. Okay. Um, what about um I think in the kitchen there's always a like a bed. Typical. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> My grandma used to have a yes. bed in her kitchen. Yeah, it's it's always there. Yeah. So yeah. um how do we say call that bed? A poor. So we have beds in the kitchen and we have beds in the room as well. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. So a core. All right. Okay. Is there anything else you think we've left out? Um, I told you you're the one understanding. Mm-hmm. Wow. Thank you so much, um, Prince Day, for doing this. You're always welcome. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you once again. Thank you so much for agreeing to be with us here today, and you stay blessed.